My name is Jaime Gomez. I'm a record producer, engineer. I do lots of mastering as well, and I'm a musician. I'm from a family of musicians in Colombia. I was obsessed with sound from very early on. My granddad used to be a broadcaster for radio. And since I was very little, I was fascinated by all these buttons and things. I started kind of toying around with them from an early age. And at the same time, I was obsessed with British music, like classics like, you know, Black Sabbath, Led Zeppelin, Deep Purple. Eventually, I decided to move over here to do this. I love all sorts of music, really. I know a lot of people say, oh yeah, I'm, I'm, into, I'm into everything, but I am very much into, you know, everything from, from 70s Afrobeat to death and black metal to progressive rock from the 70s to, you name it, contemporary classical, all sorts of stuff. I've worked, I've worked with a variety of artists covering everything from kind of contemporary classical music to really heavy rock kind of stuff. Anything from bands like uh, Plan B, who is a hip-hop artist, to bands like Norwegian band Ova, who are like very avant-garde and crazy, like heavy bands, classic heavy bands like Paradise Lost, Cathedral, and so on. Yeah. My role as a record producer is to get together with the band, develop their songs, capture the sounds that work for the songs, and then record, mix, and master. I've always really liked the sound of 70s records. Uh, I think most of my favorite records were recorded to analog tape. When I kind of had enough money to get, you know, a tape machine, and I decided that uh, it was the way to go. And now I, I really like the, like the saturation you get of tape and, and the feel. I even like the hiss of tape. You know, it just, there's something about it that I really enjoy. But then I transfer to digital, where I can have the flexibility of digital, which really helps. The Hugo is just wonderful in terms of the clarity you can get out of what you're hearing. When I first heard it, I was telling the guys at Core that it sounds like listening to music in, in 3D. You know, it's like the difference between going to the normal cinema and going to the IMAX. The imaging, everything was like, oh, that cymbal is there and that violin is there. It's so, so precise. So it really helps me do my job very accurately, which I think is very, very important. My normal kind of workflow would be, I'm here with the Hugo TT. When I'm mixing or recording, I use it for my monitors so I can get, you know, it's just really good for uh, getting really good clarity of what I'm doing. And then what I will do is uh, with the little guide, the little Hugo, it's great because I can just then take it to my living room where I have my hi-fi and I always check my mixes on my hi-fi and my masters as well. And it also gives me the portability of I can be working in, in my dining room, for example. I can be just sitting there just doing some editing or checking some mixes on my headphones or something. And it's just such a small, amazing device that you can take anywhere that's also battery operated and you can just guarantee that you're gonna get a really, really good sound out of it. <laughs>